Hey planner babes, it's Mandy from Create with Mandy and today I thought it would be fun to go ahead and put together this storage tote and show you how much can really fit inside. I'm super excited to get this. Uh, I remember when the, the first one came out, the champagne colored one, super excited. So I'm glad to actually have one. Um, looks really cool. I don't really even um, travel that much with my planner stuff. But I think this is an awesome and pretty storage to just sit in your craft room and just have storage that way, like, you know, inside instead of taking it places. So super excited to have this. So let me go ahead and cut this tag off and go ahead and assemble it. So I'm going to link below um, the link to this if, if you want to get it or even just look at the listing for it or whatever. So here we go. Here's what it looks like. On the outside, it's got the fabric here. It's really nice, um, seems very durable. And then it's like a leathery, I'm sure it's um, fake leather though. So that's good. Um, it's got that section right here and the handles and it's a nice dark blue. Okay, so open it up. It's nice and stiff. Um, the walls, you know, are nice and stiff. Let me go ahead and pull this up a little bit. Okay. And yeah, so let's go ahead and put it together. I think it's super simple. So this looks like the bottom. I'm going to go ahead and stick that in there. Nice. Okay. There are directions on the back as well. So it says after you put the bottom to do the vertical divider. So there's three of them. So let's see which one it is. It looks like this one maybe. Okay. Vertical by adhering the Velcro strips. Okay, and then the smallest one goes in that compartment and then the last divider goes in the center. Okay. Yeah, so this is the one that goes here so we got the velcro here on both sides and that's where it's going to attach so and i didn't read the instructions beforehand i just glanced at it so this is like a real review <laughs> okay so that's actually really easy um pretty sturdy while i shake the camera and everything so yeah, okay, next is this little one that goes in here. Let's see, I think I might, no. No, I got that right. I was afraid that this was, that actually might be backwards, yeah. Hmm, think so. Okay, I put this one in backwards because um, this and this need to line up. Instead, they're at like an angle right from each other. Let's see. After this assembly too, you can just leave it together. You can take it back apart if you wanna collapse it down again. So that's really good. Okay, now that these two are lined up, I can go ahead and put this one. All right. Nice, okay, perfect. And then now this big one. And then, you know, you could always leave this without the divider if you wanted as well. So there's a lot of options here. All right. Nice. So when it's all put together, you have four compartments. That was really easy. And like I said, you can always take it back apart. So there we go. Really nice. So let's go back to the front. Has the Happy Planner logo embossed here. I believe that's what it's called. Maybe it's debossed because it's like going inside. Anyway, 
So here we go. Let me go ahead and grab some of my things to put inside and see how everything fits. So here's some sticker books. Um, they fit perfectly over here. I bet you could fit six or seven in this small compartment. So you could probably fit a lot over there. I'm gonna guess like 10 probably. So we got those. Here's one more. So five will fit like nice. I bet six would fit snug. Probably even one more. So let me grab these two planners. Just two classic size planners. There's still room for another one. Here's a big size planner. Let me put it in with the discs the other way. Okay, the big size planner is barely fitting. It's very snug, but it's still doable. So it does fit, it's just a little snug, which is all right. But yeah, I was afraid that wasn't gonna fit for a second. There we go. Okay, so you, that three planners, probably your limit. You could definitely fit some stuff right here if you needed. Um, yeah, and then looks like you could probably fit some more here. Let me grab these guys. These ones are so pretty. Oh, totally. Totally, you could probably fit another classic one here if you needed. Then let's see about over here. And just grab these guys. Just grabbing everything for my small box, basically. Wow, this fits so much more than you think, honestly. I was looking at it on the on the uh, package here and like online, and it's you really can fit way more than you think. And it's so sturdy that you don't feel like you're going to like break it or anything. So yeah, I really like that. That's gonna be really nice to have. I'm so glad that I got one. So yeah, I think that's probably about it. Let me know down below if you still have any more questions. I mean, you can, you can see pretty good that you have a lot of space and you could definitely fit some more things. Hmm, let me see. Um, how about the journals? I'm thinking, let's see how the journals fit. So these guys, let's see. So they are too big for this compartment over here. That's what I wanted to know. And so they could totally just fit in here. So there you go. And I think that's probably about it. Yeah. All right, guys, so let me know down below if you have any more questions, and I will definitely get back to you if I have the answer. Um, but I'll, I can go ahead and, like, test out and see if different sizes fit or whatever. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. Go check this out. It is called a storage tote. So, yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.